In other news we are reporting tonight, Henderson police are looking for suspects following a deadly home invasion. One person is dead while the homeowner recovers at the hospital. Eyewitness News Sam Neff went to the neighborhood where this all came down. Henderson police got the call just around midnight and quickly responded to the apartments here on Wood Drive. A man who went to the door expecting pizza says he had to use deadly force to protect himself. We heard what sounded like firecrackers. It was popping or an explosion. It's disturbing now that we know exactly what went down. Police found 27-year-old Zachary Pearson, who was alone at his home on Wood Drive, badly injured by gunfire. He told officers he went to his front door expecting the pizza he ordered. When he opened the door, four to five men then rushed into the home. One of the men the one who was later found deceased, um, shot Mr. Pearson. Pearson said he ran to find his own gun and fired back at his attacker, only to be shot again. The suspect, who has yet to be identified, was pronounced dead on scene. Pearson was rushed to a hospital where he underwent surgery, and the others ran away. Not what one neighbor, who chose to remain anonymous, wanted to hear. And this is so scary because I'm standing here and I'm looking at you know, the place in question, if there are three or four other people out running in the neighborhood, then that makes it very frightening. And HPD hasn't found the other suspects or identified why this happened, but could confirm Pearson's reason for checking the door. The pizza guy did show up. That was legitimate. He came not long after our officers arrived, and he said he had a pizza and it was supposed to go to that apartment. No, I don't think it's connected any way whatsoever with the pizza guy. Because the suspect who was found dead didn't have any identification on him, his autopsy has been delayed. HPD says that will happen tomorrow in Louisville. I'm told Pearson's injuries are serious. In Henderson, Sam Neff, Eyewitness News.